Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome back to Seinfeld's Grand Theft Auto 3 100% guided walkthrough. So we are over here in Staunton still. Uh, the last video we just uh, unlocked the final main story mission for Grand Theft Auto 3, but we still had some additional side missions to do. Uh, so this is going to be the first one at the uh, payphone called Bling Bling Scramble. This is King Courtney. Me yaddy posse could do with them rude boy driver and people is saying you the man. Get to the waste ground opposite the stadium in a car and wait for the other hopefuls. I've got been watching checkpoints all over Staten. First driver to a checkpoint gets the bling bling. Then it's on to the next stop. If you get more checkpoints than any other driver, I can have me a little work for you. Now, of course, with this being an underground type of checkpoint race type of thing, um, you can do some things that could really screw up the other uh racers or contestants in this scramble uh so do make sure you have some uh rocket launcher ammo and then when you're ready kind of face southeast and go to the marker to start this next part so of course get a fast car if you want really you don't need it if you do this strategy that i'm going to show you also here are the other three contestants one of them's in the patriot bobcat and, and uh cheetah so as soon as it starts You can go ahead and head over here to the uh, first checkpoint, and of course they're going to be following in after you. Now know that these checkpoints, it's not technically a race, but it is something that, um, there you go, one of 15. Uh, it, they just kind of appear all over the map. You just have to go from one place to the next. So when you get a little bit ahead of them, a little too fast, oh, okay, there's that one and that one. As you can see, you can take them out and yeah, you'll, no, 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 I do not want this. Did not mean to get into that. Come on. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah, don't worry about that. Um, you'll notice that these still will appear on the map, but you know you don't fail the mission for taking them out. Uh, now, of course, I missed that one vehicle, the first racer here, which is this guy. And of course, if you heard, he did get the uh, uh, next checkpoint, but that's fine because we are going to take him out uh, there we go and there we are he's out so all three are out now so the rest of it should be easy as pie just getting the rest of them uh, so like I said we're gonna be getting 14 out of 15 because the uh, that racer that I just took out did manage to get one so we could take as much time as we want to get the remaining checkpoints uh, of course, I'm not going to do that. I'm still going to try to go as fast as I can uh, to get them. So there you go. Five out of 15. And like I said, they do appear all over the map. It's not really, like I said, a path for it. It's just wherever they appear, they will appear. Just go around, you know, weaving in and out of roads and stuff like that through traffic to get them. Um, now, what I'm going to go ahead and do is probably instead of just kind of cutting this off, I'm going to actually speed it up. You know, take my voice out, obviously, but speed this up uh, so you can see more or less like where the checkpoints are going to be. Uh, yeah, so let's go for it. Okay, here we go, and 13 out of 15, have one more to go. I mean, remember, like I said, it's going to be 14 out of 15 because the other racer got the one. Uh, because I aimed too high when I was trying to take him out, but it's fine. Uh, you, know, so you just have to get at least one, one more than any of the other racers, of course, which is, uh, would make it very difficult for me to see or know or check out because... You know, if you have three racers going after all, you know, the same uh, checkpoints or whatever, then, like, how can you keep track of that? You know, how can you keep count of how many racers have what? I don't know. Anyway, so the final one here is basically going to be back over where we started at here at the stadium. And there we go. And here's the 
Final one, there we go, $14,000. You came first with 14 successful checkpoints. Of course, you get $1,000 for each one you collect. If you manage to get you know, 15, you get the $15,000. So whatever, anyway, that's it for that one. You know, Easy enough if you do that kind of strategy of taking the other racers out. I mean, you can do it either way you want. You can even do drive-bys. So with that being done, we'll be at 94% towards 100% completion with 64 out of 73 missions passed. So that is it for this one with this new mission strand. Uh, hope you all enjoyed. Love you all. Peace out. Till next time. Adios. All right, everyone. Well, I hope you liked that video. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Know what I mean? Know what I mean? Uh, if you want the next one in the series, then just click that top video right there. Or if you want some random video that YouTube put out for you, then click this bottom one right here. Uh, and of course, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet. And also hit that bell icon to know when a new video will be uploaded. So thank you all for watching and see you next time.